Hello. Today we're going to be discussing how to build a shooting range in your basement. Some of the things you're going to need, a room big enough to have a shooting range. It's the first and foremost thing. Second thing, you're going to need targets, your gun. For this particular use, we're going to be using standard BB gun. And I'll show you the safety tips for handling that later. Okay, so right now we're in our laundry slash storage room. Laundry water cooler over there. I'm going to be shooting towards the back of the room. I'll show you the uh, area here quickly. Just bear with me here for a second. Okay, what we're going to be shooting at is this bookshelf here. I'm going to be making a target and putting it right here. If all goes well, if I hit the target, because paper's in front, it will keep the BBs back there without having to go flying off all over the place. And a book fell. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, now. Safety, equip safety equipment you need for this. A pair of safety glasses for using the BB gun. Your BB gun. Your shots. And paper and pen to make your target. So what we're going to do, because I don't have any printer ink in my printer right now, we're just going to make a little makeshift target for ourselves. So, big circle, little circle, with crosshairs. Plain and simple. Just like that. And what we do, we walk over to our target area. There we are. post up, we try to post up, there we go, our target. Normally I would use staples here, but I don't know where my staple gun is at the moment. There we are. And there we go. The object here is to make this as tight as possible so that there's no play. So the BBs won't actually go flying off back at me. All right, there we go. We're up. Next thing we need to do is make sure there's nobody's watching us. So we close this door so nobody can come in while we're shooting. Go. Door is closed. All right. Now we're going to load up some BBs. I got a few BBs right here. This particular gun will hold about 14, between 14 and 16 shots. We're just going to load in a uh, few for the purposes of this demonstration. Load this in here. Now, safety tip. Never, ever put your finger in the trigger until you're ready to fire. Always have your finger lining along the side. When you're ready to fire, that's when you put your finger in the trigger and slowly pull. And that's when the shot comes in. Okay? So the gun, and you never, ever point this at anybody. So, put on our glasses, just like this. Give ourselves a little bit better shot here. We'll do a couple of shots with you facing me, and then I'll do a couple of shots with the uh, camera pointing at the target. Cock it. Aim. I'm not the best shot in the world, but it works. So if we come back over here and we take a look, just like this, and you'll be able to see. Hang on a second here. There we go. That all three shots have hit the target. Now let's move over here for a sec. Well, the bonus is if I reach behind here, 
Oh, looks like they did bounce out. Oh, I'll pick them up off the floor in a little bit. Okay, I'm going to leave the camera right here. Just back it off just a titch so that you can see the shots as they actually hit their target area. There we are. Good enough. Okay. Standing back at my original spot. And there we have it. Alrighty. Well, gotta tilt this up a bit. Sorry about this, guys. There we are. And back it off. Don't need an extreme close up of me. So there we have it. When you're done, always make sure that you pop the clip and keep it separate from the gun. Uh, other than that, have fun. Make sure you have at least 12 feet of space to shoot from. You want to shoot from at least 12 feet out. So, have a good day.